So if you clicked on this video, it's more than likely because of the title and this is what it is. I talk to my revivers, which are my subscribers. I don't like to say subscribers. So if you're new and you're coming because of the title of this video, I call you my revivers. So I told you guys that I have been, I have been procrastinating when it comes to my weight. Weight loss is something that is very difficult. It is very difficult. And I remember the times when I achieved the uh, goal set out for myself in my health, um, with my health and wellness and stuff, it made me feel so good. So I just think about those times of weight loss and those times of seeing the scale move and the non-scale victories. And if you don't know what that means, that means like you put on a shirt that don't fit and then a month later the shirt does fit. Well, this is going to be a little bit different. This journey is going to be a little bit different. I literally have this here, right here, stapled. Stapled together. Oh, I need to staple it again. Hold on. Stapled together. I thought I'm going to staple down. And this is my actual goal for myself. By June 17th, 2019, my goal is to lose a certain amount of weight. I don't want to share that. Why don't I? Because I found out when I do that, it mentally keeps my brain on a over processing mode to the point where it, be, it gives me anxiety. So one person, I shared this with one person so they can hold me accountable. It is inside of here and I will see. And um, on that time, I'm sorry, guys, I'm just I'm really nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous. I'm nervous because I'm getting ready to start this and, and, and try to go full fledged and get my life back in order and it's just so it's so nerve-wracking because when you love food and you love to eat and to know that you're just transforming your whole lifestyle from that it can be a, a really scary slash anxiety 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 will like take over and that's how I feel right now. And, and I want you guys to know that this is how I feel. Why? Because I get people emailing me, commenting about, am I on my journey? No, I'm not. You see this? No, I'm not. Um, am I uh, working out? No, I'm not. I'm not doing none of the above at the time. After the summertime, life turned in so many ways. And y'all know I ended up having that surgery. And that just kind of threw me in a hunk. And I just was back to my old ways of eating. And I've been eating like that and gaining weight. And I look at this. This is ridiculous. Gaining weight. And this is how I record because of this. You get what I'm saying? So um, if, I, if, if, if I feel comfortable enough when it's time to edit all the pieces I need to put with this video, I will show you my highest weight if I don't. So here it is. I decided to put my pride aside. You guys have no clue. I'm so emotional right now. Another thing I didn't speak about is how I'm so winded. I'm so winded walking up and down the stairs. <sighs> I'm not old at all. And this life that I'm living is just not my best life. And I desire my best life. And I set pride aside to share this with you so we can push together and I can inspire you. Don't please respect it, but please know that when I do hit the June 17th date, I will share that video and show you the day that it was actually created to show you that was official weight at that time. I'm just not, I, this right here is so embarrassing. It's so embarrassing. You know why it's embarrassing? It's embarrassing because I know better. It's embarrassing because I was a trainer. It's embarrassing because I know that this is, is the path to an unhealthy physical body and elements i mean different elements start to occur in your body that are not good and i don't want them so with that being said this is staple this is staple and the time i'm getting my phone it is 6 13 on march 24th sunday march 24th i'm going to put 6 13 on this and we're going to remember this 6 13 p.m that's the time this is going to be the same envelope that I opened on June 17th to see where am I? Did I make it? Did I just make it? Did I surpass it or whatever? This is going to be kept. Now, this is how this journey is going to go because I want to share this with you. So if you're watching this video, this is going to be the beginning of my journey. So when you see this video, the next day will be... Um, 
the start of the journey for, for you guys. Um, so you're just only going to be one day behind me because I want to do this daily. A friend of mine said, just do it daily, do it daily. And I was like, I really didn't want to do it daily. But the way that we decided that it would be good for me to do this daily, it will, be, it will work out for me and it'll help somebody out there. I will be posting daily, Monday through Friday, just Monday through Friday about this journey. Like what I ate for that day. I'm going to get snippets of what I ate for that day um, and a mini confession of how I felt that day. Not only that, um, I'm going to uh, my working out. I'm hitting the gym. I'm hitting the gym. And you guys will see this. By the time you see this, I would have already hit the gym um, because you will be seeing it the next day. That way it gives me time to get it out to you guys. So if you guys have any questions or comments, please leave it below. The reason I'm doing this because I've been having so many pains, so many body pains. And, you know, we don't want to face it because we don't look like our age these days. You know, they say, what, 20 is the new 40, 30 is the new 50 or whatever the case may be. We don't look like our age. So with that being said, I'm like, even though I may not look my age, I don't want to feel my age. You get what I'm saying? I'm feeling my age. And so with that being said, it's crazy because I talked to a friend of mine from years back and she's getting ready to go have the procedure. And if you're watching this, I love you and I'm thinking positive for you. We want it to work out for you. That's all I'm hoping for you. I'm just too afraid to do that. I just want to go hard. And I explained this to her. I explained to her, I said, I think my problem is I would not want to, at this point, my mindset, you have to do which, what is best for you. But my mindset is you have restrictions even after you have that particular surgery. So after I get to my goal and, and my health um, weight that I desire, then I'm restricted. You get what I'm saying? And I'm just not a restrictive person. I'm too creative. I don't like to be in a box and I'm not a restrictive person. So it's hard for me to say, okay, if I get this, then I can never eat this or I will never like this again or I won't be able to do this. I want to for, I want to go forward with a lifestyle that's free, easy, and simple. And after I get to my weight desire, my desired weight, I want to be able to be moderate, moderate with the things that I still enjoy but don't indulge to the point where it's causing stuff like this. So that's why I'm doing this. I'm doing like y'all um, y'all don't even understand right now. I feel so bad for the people that I have inspired and I fell off the track. I know I'm not perfect. I know I'm not perfect. So that's why I did not want to boggle my brain with that number. I don't want to see that number anymore. What I will try to do is insert maybe one or two things that I really desire to get into in this video so you can see them. So every 30 days, we're going to go try that thing on again. Now, the total time is 85 days. So we'll go 30 days, 60 days. And then on the 85th day, we'll try them on again, which will be the weigh-in day and the time to see if I hit my, um, my mark. So that's how we're gonna do this okay so i bought this from old navy it is a medium if y'all can see that it is a medium okay yeah medium for who not my chunky stuff but i can fake it at the gym right yeah and this is all i get this is it this is it nothing more nothing less i can't if I do this and then look, it jacks way up <laughs> and it's not supposed to be there. So I can't fit this. This is something, this is going to be a non-scale victory for me to see how this fits on me as time goes on. So, all right, y'all. Okay. Um, so I'm going to be sharing with you throughout this journey how I package snacks. So like Saturday and Sundays will be other videos that I already recorded and did the work on. They may not be healthy meals because those are meals and stuff that I just don't want to get rid of those videos because I recorded them. So I'm going to still share those videos. I'm going to still share those videos, but it'll be a Saturday or Sunday. But if I have something extra that I didn't do on the day of one of my journeys, which I might still, I think I'll try to throw it in. No, I, I'll separate it because I want to show you guys how I package my snacks. When I say I'm going hard, I'm prepackaging my snacks, like my olives and grapes and different things. I want to prepackage them myself. I went to go buy olives in a container and it was four of them. It was $3.99 for four little things, just like you get the peaches in the cups, like the dull type of things, $4. I said, really? When I can buy a can of olives? Sorry. I mean, 
my thing is this we may not be able to get all organic and all seeded fruits but it's better to eat a unseeded fruit than to eat a piece of cake you get what I'm saying? So this journey that I'm going to share with you, I'm going to be sharing my menu for that week. So you will know what's supposed to be eaten. So every Monday, I'll probably be sharing what our meal should be for that week. But then every day, I'm going to be sharing the actual things that I eat, snacks and different random things that I eat throughout the um, day. It's not like I'm going to share everything, meaning like... Um, every snack i don't want to make them long but y'all just go with the flow with me and just go on this journey with me your girl is coming up on the big 4-0 and my birthday i planned a huge cruise with some of you ladies and whoever else wants to join so because of that um this is also motivation for me like this is motivation i don't want to go on that cruise and be unhealthy and be tired and lethargic and just don't want to do stuff and that's how i feel i feel like i don't want to do stuff i feel like i'm lazy um my knees are still popping my ankles are still popping and i'm having these issues and i know that they won't get better they're definitely going to get worse because my body is not meant to carry the amount of weight that i'm letting it carry at this time and I know it's somebody out there going through the same thing. It's somebody out there going through the same thing. I understand they say when you get to a certain age, it's hard to lose weight. I don't believe none of that. I believe if you mentally are prepared and you get yourself together and you put your diet in a place where it's a healthy track and it is things that are not um, where you're over consuming calories and stuff like that, then I think it's a go. So I'm going to be sharing how I work out. Um, so I have a book and I, when I say I'm ready, my book is already ready today. Literally, as I sp speak to you, it's Sunday tomorrow, late, like four, between four and five in the morning. I'm trying to get Naya to go with me and she says she wants to, but she has school. So I'm trying to figure out if we should go really early in the morning. That way she can come home and get back in the bed for school and then get up and go to school. So we're going to figure that out. So she may be going with me. So, um, I'm already ready. I have Monday and Tuesday already ready and I'm trying to fill it out. So like now I got um wake up at 5:30 and my goal was to get to the gym by 6 cuz I already be showering and ready and the gym is not far and then um be there no later than 6 6:15 and then um work out for like an hour and then come home uh schedule my videos for my inspiration channel and then edit my videos grocery shop now I was gonna grocery shop on Mondays but I actually liked grocery shopping today on a Sunday so that might switch up either way it goes we stick into the menu I've been saving money like crazy with a menu um, on food we're doing it this way so um, then it says cook by 530 no later and then 10 p.m. I want to be in a bed and I want to make sure my phone and everything is charged for the next morning for my music and to take pictures and footage for to share with you guys um so that's kind of that day what i have planned um and then tuesday i have that plan and so i have my little boxes and i'll check off everything i know i need to do and every day that's what i want to do um so these videos will be like my mini confession slash what i did for that day and how i um worked out or whatever the case may be that little envelope is not going to be open until the 17th of june that's when i will open it um I'm planning something for that month and I will share that with you at that time if you probably probably will find out before that but yeah so I got my little note so that's why I keep looking down so I got my schedule I want to be in a bed at a certain time I stay up too late I need to turn off these devices and I want to teach my kids to turn off these devices as well it's unhealthy it's like we keep the TVs on. We keep everything on. And my phone bings. I'm picking it up in the middle of the night. I don't want that. I don't want my life to be consumed with electronics. Not only am I trying to get myself physically healthy, I want to get mentally healthy. I want to get everything in alignment with the lifestyle that I truly want, which is simplicity, joy, peace, and health and wellness that's what i'm going for and if you're ready to go for it with me we could do this together and so as i slowly get myself together i'm going to open my group back up to more people on facebook and share more but i need to get that momentum i just need to step my foot in that gym it is something about getting in the gym for me i, I can work out at home i can do that but i've been trying to basically fight going to the gym because I didn't want to spend the money but I said hey it's $21.99 a month 
I can get some massages if I just want to go and just have the, the little water hydro thing massage me. Um, I can go to any gym. I said, that's $268 for the year for me and my peace of mind. It's worth it. So I'm going to be joining Planet Fitness and um, getting it in. And I want to give you just enough because I want you to understand that this is a journey for me. And I'm human and I'm trying my best to push hard. I'm going, no, no, I'm not trying. My, I, the words that we use, we have to really pay attention to them. I am going to push hard as I can to achieve my goal and to not be sitting in front of you again as I am right now having to do this all over again. I don't want to do this again. I don't want to do this again. I hope this is inspiring to somebody. I hope someone else is saying enough is enough and they want to do it as well. Um, yeah, I I can't. I can't. It's too much for me. And I'm not happy with my clothing. I'm not happy with getting dressed. I'm not happy with anything. My skin is not right. My skin is not right because I'm not eating right. I'm eating a lot of processed, toxic, just, I mean, a lot of things that I shouldn't. I'm talking about like cookies and candies and stuff like that. I'm eating a lot of things that I shouldn't. Um, so yeah, I just want you to go on this journey with me and, and I'm just going to try to fiddle my way through it to figure it out what works best for me in the gym and all that good stuff because I'm a big girl and I got a lot of weight that I need to release from my body and it's not going to happen overnight. It's not going to happen overnight, but I thank you guys for encouraging me. I thank you for pushing me. I thank you for your support. I thank you for all of the above. I'm sorry this is a long video, um, but I definitely wanted to share that with you guys. So stay tuned for tomorrow's video, and you will see what this journey is for me. All right? I love you guys, and remember, stick to your script because you are the best at it. And don't just say living my best life let your life really really be a replica of that and mine isn't you know why because i don't know anyone whose best life is feeling achy cranky lethargic anxiety and just all these things and i feel like once i get this energy i can zoom and do everything i need to do in my home that i really want to do as far as more purging you guys know i did that already we talked about this on the live but i just still need to release more I still need to release more until I'm really happy with what I see because it's a lot of noise in different areas of my home still that I gotta release. And I'm going to. I'm going to. Not trying to. I'm going to. And you guys are going to be on this journey with me. And that journey for the home and the purging and stuff, once I get my momentum here, I have not forgot about that. We are going to do that challenge there to purge things that we don't need, that don't bring us joy on that end. Y'all know I did Con Marie over a year and a half ago. Um, and everybody's down with the flow now and trying to do it because of the Netflix special. But yeah, y'all know your girl purged and decluttered over uh, almost two years ago. Yeah, it was almost three years ago. Yeah, almost two years ago. So with that being said, I love you guys again. And let me get off of here. And I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see what I can stick in in between. Um, more than likely the clothes, the what I'm going to try on is going to be in earlier. After I said it, I'm going to try to stick it in there somewhere. So yeah, so I want to stick that in there. And that's basically it, guys. So come on this journey with me. All right. We're just going to do it. Let it go. This is where I am on social media. Be sure to check me out, but also go check out my other channel, The CPR Vibe. The link is in the description box where we talk about all things reviving our lives. There are many playlists and how-tos on this channel that can help you save your coins. You can also see my renovation journey. If you are new to this channel, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so you're alerted of all the new videos. Later, Gators.